the basics of electric guitar pedals. Many instruments have one key sound and stick to it. The electric guitar is different, with today's technology, guitars have a vast arsenal of sounds. Guitars sound different from guitar to guitar. The choice of amp also drastically changes the tone of the instrument. The biggest factor in getting different and unique sounds is the use of pedals. From the edge of U2 to Jimi Hendrix, many famous guitarists use pedals to alter their signature sound. Here are some of the most commonly used pedals. The most famous guitar pedal is probably the wah pedal. The wah pedal, getting its name from its trademark wah wah sound, is a pedal commonly associated with guitarists like Jimi Hendrix and Tom Morello, Rage Against the Machine. It is controlled like a gas pedal on a car, pushing down and up adjusts a filter that creates a wah wah effect. A good song to hear this on is Rage Against the Machine's Bulls on Parade or the intro to Hendrix's Voodoo Child. The Basics of Electric Guitar Pedals The next two pedals are a reverb and delay. Reverb creates an instant echo that is comparable to yelling in a cathedral or a large open building. Delay is another type of echo, however it is multiple controlled repeats. There are many types of delays, but they mainly fall into the categories of analog or digital delays. The most prominent user of delay pedals is the edge of U2. Listen to any U2 song and there is likely the extreme use of delay and reverb to create lush soundscapes. The final types of pedals we'll be discussing are the overdrive, distortion, and fuzz pedals. Almost everybody uses one of these types of pedals, as they are the unsung heroes of guitar pedals. Overdrives are typically used to add a bit more grit and drive to an amp. Distortions are used to add a full-on distortion to a clean amp. Fuzz is at in your face, overly distorted, fuzz saw sound. The song that comes to mind for great fuzz tone for me is the song by the Black Keys Strange Times. Of course, there is a lot more to know about pedals, and a lot more pedals to know about. I chose not to mention modulation pedals such as flangers, phasers, and chorus because those are much more advanced than the ones I have mentioned above. 